Hey everybody, it's Ryan. If you're looking for a projector that uh, has a lot of features, this video might just be for you. So the first feature you might notice there is the auto focus. And so regardless of the lighting chain situation, indoor or outdoor, this has a built-in autofocus that is uh, 4K, 1080p also, and it will automatically adjust because it's being held in this example. So it's, dry, it's trying to, it's like, hold on, I'm trying to focus. Uh, let me get closer and I got it. I have no idea how the technology works. I don't care to know how the technology works. I just know that uh, this is for indoor or outdoor use. So like outdoor, for example, if the lighting was changing and it needs to adjust the focus, it's going to do that in real time. I think they call it dynamic. Pretty cool. Pretty cool stuff. It does come with a remote like this. does have a, about a five foot power cable and then also comes with a HDMI cable. Uh, but it can run off Bluetooth, run off uh, a network, which is also cool. And then it has a built in, especially if you're connected to a network, it has built in things uh that i'm gonna share with you here size of this is also pretty small and it does have a way to with this screw here at the bottom it can be it can be mounted permanently um and this allows for movement that is you know i'd say about vertical so if you just wanted to like have it shine straight up to you know at a very low angle but for this example we're just going to have it positioned right like this uh the in this example the wall being projected on is probably at the top this is a, a ceiling example <laughs> uh but the wall here is about 15 and then back in the back is roughly about 20 feet away from the actual projector now there's also ambient light and everything else uh just for this review but from an example standpoint, very high, um, very high resolution, quite surprisingly high. Easy to navigate, especially if you're using the remote. It has a manual focus. So if for by chance, by chance, if the autofocus is not to the user's liking, then with a couple of clicks of focus uh, plus or negative, we have that option as well. It does have built in speakers, three watt speakers from a volume standpoint. Navigation is pretty easy to use. Very simple, up, down, left, right, and OK. Home, and then you have sort of a um, um, sort of a, a tool uh, option here. This is not radio frequency. It is um, infrared, so you have to be pointing it at the front because right there, it has to be pointed at that. Just you know, a small uh, technical aspect of it to it. You know, so when using it, you got to be able to like, if it's behind you, you got to be like, you know, doing this number, um, you know, pointing at wherever you need to go. All the stuff that is being displayed is what's preloaded on there. So YouTube, uh, Prime Video, Hulu, Netflix, all these different apps or whatever are already preloaded on there. Uh, it also has Bluetooth capability, so you can connect to Bluetooth. And if you want to, you know, do something from, you know, a phone or whatever, you have that option as well. Laptop, obviously, it can be hardwired in via the HDMI. But there's also a couple different extra ports. On the side, it does have a couple uh, USB ports and a audio port. So you got you a whole bunch of different options as far as how to get the best experience that kind of suits your needs. The audio jack can be used for, uh, let's just say, home headphones, if that's your liking. They do does not come with that. To show how bright this is in a, a dark uh, scenario, clarity is on point. And if wanting to really refine the, uh, really, this is an example of, of really refining, manually refining the auto focus, um, which might be needed if you're in a situation where you have uh, for example, at the top, this is much closer than at the bottom. So all these apps, music, video, uh, we have down here, um, all these pre-loaded um, app store options mirroring the screen. So if you want to connect this to, let's say, a laptop and have it mirrored, you have that capability as well. Again, either hardwired or network or Bluetooth. This is what the video preloaded screen looks like and all the different options that come with this music and then you have your settings which kind of gives you a rundown of the things such as media center 
import, projector, um, language options, memory card, Bluetooth, networking, and, and everything else. Now, full disclosure, this company sent this to me, said, Ryan, tell us what you think about our indoor and outdoor projector. Hopefully, I answered all your questions, and we'll talk to you soon.